So when you move in, uh, I'm sure one of the first things you'll want to do is to fit curtain poles, curtain battens. Uh, you may even want to hang pictures, mirrors, etc. Please be very careful um, about when you're hanging stuff on the walls. So I just want to quickly explain. Um, so for example, we're downstairs in this house. Um, sockets, switches and radiators, everything goes vertically up the wall. So there will be a cable going vertically here and there will be a pipe for the heating going straight up here for the radiator. We advise that you use um, a, um, a scanner that you can get from like B&Q, places like that, they're quite cheap, that can pick up the metal. Um, one other way for the heating, you can turn the heating on full blast and you can feel where the pipe is behind the wall. Um, but uh, just be careful because these cables and these pipes won't necessarily be dead level. They can be slightly off by a, few, a, a centimetre or two. So it's always wise to double check. And if we just come around to this radiator here, any radiator underneath the windowsill has got to go up to the ceiling as well. Um, as you can see, this one has actually got to work its way around the window. So on either side of this window reveal, there'll be a water pipe that's going up to the ceiling. Um, so you must check in this location here and this location here, that before you start putting screws into the wall, that there is no, that you're not going to go through the through the pipe. Um, everything I've just explained with with it, regards to everything going upstairs, up into the up into the ceiling, it's flipped round upstairs. So upstairs, everything goes down. Okay, unless you're in a three-story house where you've got the middle floor, um, which will have pipes and cables from the top floor coming down. Um, now, just because you can see something doesn't mean that's the only pipe or cable that's in the house, okay? So it's really obvious with the things that are fitted on the outside, but you've also got to consider cables for light, light uh, pendants. Uh, you've got to think about TV aerials going up into the loft space. So don't just walk up to a wall and think, here's the, here's the sockets, there's a cable here, there could be something else on the wall. Um, so yeah, it's very important to think that.